All right, let me show you how to make a quick and fairly cheap solar charger for your batteries. So you need a solar panel, which I had this one, small one. This one is framed, so it's easy to handle around, but you can have a flexible. There's some, a lot of options to buy. So you need one of these, you need solar controller. These are the cheap models. They're around eight or nine dollars on Amazon. It might be even cheaper on some Chinese sites. That's a 30 amp and it's more than it's more than you need. That's probably a 50 watt. So 50 watt, if you remember your electrical 50 watt, how many amps is that? On a 12 volt nominal, you divide 50 by 12, which is four and something, but it's four amps and that's 30 amps. So it could handle like seven of those. And you need like a clamps, you probably have those laying around. So now we need to connect them. So just make sure you put the positive and negative at the right in the right spot. It says here that it's a solar panel here. You can read the instructions, but plus and minus. The battery plus and minus and this is for the load which I rarely use but it can be useful if you want some some lights at night or anything. It's got to be connected first which is a problem because we already have our solar panel connected. Well, on the wrong side but there's a reason. I'm gonna hide it because otherwise it shows some voltage which is not good. So you want to you want to kill the voltage. The reason being this is going to dictate what voltage you're on because it could be 24 and it could be 12. I'm on a John boat, so the idea being I just want to charge this without removing it from the boat. So now you see the voltage 13.7. Flip this over. So that's it. Now you have your charger and you can. You can bring it around to cars, like unused cars or, or boats like me. So that's a little charger that's pretty handy. So have fun doing it and keep your hands dirty.